press the subscribe button and hit that notification bell to never miss a video from Sam Chakwin Gaming. Hello YouTube, Sam is here guys. First thing first, I haven't been uploading for a couple of months because I had some of the big issues. So really apologies for that. I try to upload daily content for you guys. So yeah guys, without any further ado, let's just jump into this video. Alright guys, I'm on iOS 10.3.1 and let me just show you. Settings, General, About. There we go, iOS 10.3.1. So guys, I jailbreak using double helix, which is really great jailbreak. I don't have any battery issues so far, it's so good. So I haven't been updated to iOS 11 because it has some of the major issues regarding to battery performance. But in this video, I will show you top five tweaks. This will be a series of parts. I will be upload more parts really soon. So it supports those devices which are jailbroken using double helix. Other users which are jailbreak using goblin, they can also try these tweaks as well so yeah guys without any further ado let's just jump in all right guys the first trick is called anemone and as you guys see this is a th basically a theming application which allows you to install custom themes on your device so as you guys see i got some of the themes here so i just installed ios 11 theme which gives you ios 11 icons and battery and stairs bar so let me just show you another theme let's just disable these ones and enable this one just tap on preview and it will show you how this theme will look like and just tap on apply and that's it there we go as you guys see which looks really stunning it just gives you the android look that's anemone and it's available in the big boss repo for free you can try this out the second one is called smart tab now the repos are mentioned in the description make sure to add the repos this allows you to turn on the device by just double tap like this so this is really convenient you just don't have to press all the time this lock button this power button to lock your device you just have to double tap on the screen and the device will get locked that's it so this is really convenient now the third one the major one is app cake basically it allows you to install some of the paid apps and games for free guys so this is really cool but now before using app cake you just need to install app sync let me just show you just go to cydia now the sources which are need for these tweaks are mentioned in the description make sure to add those sources by just going to sources and then tap on edit and then tap on add and add the source here now once you add the sources just go to search and now don't put the space between app sync and as you guys see this one is the one app sync unified it's 6.1 install this one before you install app cake now if you want to get the app cake you can get this from the same repo app cake this is one version 5.5.7.2 so get this one and once you install this one you will see app cake on your home screen as you guys see you can install a load of ton of paid apps and paid games from this application which is really cool and the best thing about this is you will your apps will not get expired after seven days means they will be permanent on your device now now the fourth one is called audio recorder 2 now this is important it allows you to record the phone calls skype whatsapp and messenger any calls you make so let's dial this one and once as you guys see you can just tap on this button and you can basically tap on start to start the recording once the recording is over you just have to go to audio recorder and your call will be there last one but not least is called polis now this allows you to customize your control center basically you can add as many toggles as you want and you can change them according to your liking just go to settings just go to just scroll down and you will see polis just tap on configuration but bottom shelf and top shelf now in the bottom shelf i have only four of them four of the icons here now you can add money and now you can add many more by just tapping on this plus button if you just tap on plus button and you can see you can also add the apps you can also add toggles and you can also add the custom ones as well so that is super cool so now you can add i just have four icons you can add five six of them now my icons as you guys see these are in circle well if you want square ones you just have to tap on square and as you guys see the changes are live you know you don't need to respring your device so that is really cool so that is super cool now in the top shelf as you guys see i added many of the toggles here which is really convenient that wraps up the video guys i hope you like this video please make sure to hit the like button down there that is really helpful and make sure to comment down in the comment section guys tell me which are your favorite three and make sure to hit that red subscribe button down there for tons of new videos and content as always guys, Sam is here, Sunny.